Hello everyone and welcome again to Iden Power City boys and guys ladies and gentlemen welcome back we're going to build this British bus and this is the kind of old buses we used to have them in UK uh, they're not running anymore sadly but they look absolutely beautiful and I used to love them and I had a great time sitting in on all of them um, the, the inside the interior inside some of them different colors I try to use a brown normally they used to have a kind of uh, dark really really dark red color bit darker even than these it looks a little bit like a brownish leather okay anyway what we're going to start doing it now um, I'm going to try to copy every single thing from there because to be honest I just finished building it now and I want to make it as a tutorial for you as well Alrighty then, I'm going to leave some space from that one so you could build it anywhere you like. I'm going to put two tires from the back and one from the front. The space between these two tires, one, two, and you count the space, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine blocks. And then you go one, two, three on the fourth. And again, you do for the back, oops, one, two as well. So you end up with this like nine blocks by three blocks and two from the front double blocks from the back now all you have to do is just fill it all up with these slabs all over the place and let's do it a line like this that will be much quicker and basically these buses these to be really really beautiful i mean when i used to get on these kind of buses I used to always love to stand near the pole in UK I used to like standing here and while he's speeding I could just have a fresh air flying towards my face it was awesome it was really really awesome time um, sadly they removed them and um, I think they may bring something almost the same they already brought some but I haven't seen them in my area yet um, with pole as well and you Kind of decoration buses finger across they may bring them back and we will have all great time again using these stuff but i think because of too many accidents as well it happened some people they did fall of that while they holding the pole and that was a bit of trouble but it goes back to the person who's standing there how secure he is and if he can really hold enough some drivers they're really crazy but some drivers are really really fantastic as well and they try to help loads of people i've seen them you know i i got in too many buses and i know how things it goes all right as you can see we filled up all that flooring i am using my nether bricks blocks to be honest i could use red wool but for doing these slabs in here and some slabs like above to make it be like kind of roundish um we don't have red blocks to use these kind of slabs so i am going to build it again with nether blocks um with red it looked really really fantastic and if you want to try to use it with red feel free to do so as well all right let's go and do the normal i need the block of nether Alrighty then um you go one two and the front part will be the engine part and go like so just line up all these blocks all the way to the back and leave that four blocks in there and again boom boom so this is basically almost the shape of that bus and um, go one two one two this is the back window we had in there and it goes two blocks and then just go from that window side line of all these blocks oops just make sure you leave one two blocks empty and this is the front bonnet as well again from that side do the same and just go all the way hopefully this is not really confusing you in any way um, from the back you could put these ones and we need the furnaces as you can see the furnaces acts in there so I'm going to do destroy that one take the furnace put one two three and again let's re oops replace this back in there and let's do oh come on All right and we need the slabs 
I already have this lap with me. Boom, boom, boom. So this is like the engine front part. Um, all right, let me try to swap some of these stuff. I tried to put every single thing in there ready so I don't have to dig. All right, let me put the back lighting as well. Um, I did put it down there and boom, there. All right, we need the red block just to act as lights and it brings nice feature from the back and we don't need any more of these lights um number plate you could put anything oops not d no and i'll just put it in there 13579 so nice odd numbers and we're going up this is the back almost done well not completely but you know what i mean um, in there we put signs as well and I used to see that Putney bus all the time so I'm going to put Putney in that space and um, it was number 14 I believe I used to get into that bus too many times and I did use these item frames oh I already hold an item uh, not item frame sorry painting um, let me put one in there so they don't stretch and I keep applying these kind of uh, what do you call them like a drawer cabinet I have in my if I can I don't know why what's happening there just to bring some nice brownish kind of color so to act yep as you can see to act like the small banner from the back oh banner oh we can't put the banners behind them um, I wish we can that would have been fun if we can put a banner that will be absolutely beautiful so basically this is the back until now okay for the second part um, let me get rid of that and just go um mm, all right two blocks so i'm going to go from one to this is the corner and just go another line of these blocks all the way i'm trying to make it as big as i can to be honest because i want it to look kind of you know realish but you know what i mean it's not too it's not the exact size if I want to make it more how you say it, more realistic you need to make it a much 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 bigger size and you go like so and you go this is for the back window like what I did in there of course we have to do the roundish part from the top because they used to be like kind of archy kind of looking and they used to be really really beautiful i used to love them I just line up all that glass from this line and again from here and i'll be sorting out what i need to remove and what i need to add so this is goes like so oops I missed one in there one in there and just go with these blocks so this is the second level and just cover it it's basically easy to be built you know any one of you try to sit down and just try to figure out something like this probably he will build it unless he really really want to try to hustle himself for it <laughs> uh, but you can build it you can easy build it the corners remove these ones and use the slabs and the upper level just go with the slabs as well all the way and let's go like so Boom. Boom, boom. oops I love this roundish part you know they really really add loads of feature for the bus itself you'll see when I go from the outside I mean I'm doing all that I'm you know all the outside layer then we'll go from the inside as you can see the outside layer is perfect um, we need the lighting for the front headlights <laughs> headlights uh, we need the glass the glass part you put one in there you remove all right not that one there all right that one sorry for that boys and girls you need to remove this block and that block put it there one in there because this is goes the glass and now as you can see just go like so oh we can't we need to remove some of these slabs ah this is hustle come on 
can I go inside yes I can go one two three and just make sure you put this block there and continue with that all the way and this like so so you get that part done so it beautiful and just cover that with a block so kind of nice small windows looking in there you could use stairs if you like to but to be honest I think it looked nice like this so I'm going to keep it as it is and from the inside we need to put some blocks in there so let's go at the inside hopefully that part is not confusing you I'll show you what I'm talking about if I remove these blocks it's two blocks in there with the slabs as you're seeing this the furnaces from the front block as well um, two block space and just cover that corner like so I need to put a seat in here because that seat for the driver and now just did I cover that part see this is what I'm talking about you know when you build something quickly and you just have a good time yeah as you can see so he have like his own space in there we used to be I think they used to put like the baggages or um, uh, then small bag full of like food or something because they used to work long hours <sighs> and it was hard time I did it myself as well a long time ago <laughs> I don't really really I love the, the driving I love the you know cool things in these buses but the time was too long that was the really hardest part um, I couldn't imagine how much it was the timing you know like if you do early shift it was fantastic but if you do really late shift that was really really hard um, again I'm going to put a glass window in there I think this is what I did in there yep yeah. and just if I can fly cover all that up so basically it's like he have his own cabinet in there and remove these we're going to put it as a slabs like the other side as you can see there so I need to come outside and I have some slabs ready cool um, I love them I really enjoyed all these kind of buses and just go like so as you can see half half and all the way like so you can still remove these ones if you like to make it a bit by a little bit silly from the top middle part and they look awesome like this so basically this is the look of the front apart from that sign we haven't put it yet and I'm going to put it as well 14 um, shall I just call it Putney bridge yeah I think that will be nice did I call it Putney bridge in there yep from the back what did I call it only Putney yeah I think I did it Putney <laughs> okay so this is from Putney to Putney bridge <laughs> obviously it doesn't matter anyway it's only a sign and I don't want to waste too much time on it finger crossed we get a quick side in there I try to put these ones so I try to skip some of that while I'm putting the, the painting in there otherwise it, you'll be waiting for like 10,000 hours <laughs> okay so we have the signs we have we haven't we missed the number plate again one three five seven nine okay and the sides it all right we need the glass some of these glass will be removed I think it goes two and two just go with the blocks to add some more feature for it again from that side two and two grab the glass okay so that is looking awesome pictures will add tons of painting will add tons and tons of texture um, like that one it covers all this corner and I love it oh oh that's a huge TV so I wanted like the square ones now I can't get it okay just put some paintings not that one come on all right <laughs> vending machine yeah that, that will be advertising for a vending machine in there all right that goes well 
just drops any painting you know to add some nice features for it apart from this tv one i think this is enough for that side yep wow did you see that we got a kiss in there we got a kiss in there <laughs> okay and again from the back um oops that would be beautiful um i'm thinking to miss two blocks i think i did miss in there one block mm. all right i don't want to you know put too too much on on the buses I'm trying to go as easy as i can as you can see just keep applying these pictures they look like or these paintings they look a bit like advertising ads or you know some cool stuff that one looks like oh wow i got the tv twice all right i think that one is too much i need a small one in there okay let me put this in there so it doesn't stretch not mirror come on come on i think I put two small ones will be much better but if you put one in there that's too big all right and that looks nice as well although i didn't put anyone in there but i liked it like so and make sure you put some on these lines like this not true <laughs> like this and well these stuff it's up to you whatever you want to add you can add but they really add loads of feature for the bus itself as well all right we need one more in here and one no. okay now let's go and hit for the inside part no more pictures we need the pole when we hold on to and um, let's get rid of the stuff i need stairs i need the flooring i used gray flooring in here and well the roof is red anyway so um it's up to you whatever you want to use as well go one two and go one and then you go from above it um all right that's a full block cool i was thinking what's happening well it was the correct measures because we need a full block so we will be able to put some seats inside as well all the way boom all that will be covered anyway when we put the seats make sure you start from the front line so you miss one put two 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 and we're going to put a conductor for it as well that will be cool <laughs> conductor and one from the back as well as you can see um the seats is done now what i need is some carpeting so that will look like one good looking boss <laughs> okay um you could put some heads just to make it look like there is some people sitting on it and they looking like wow this is freaking this one looking outside and that one looking straight just put them random you know this one looking like really outside and that one you know like when you see people sitting on the buses they always looking somewhere else and thinking oh this is beautiful the best part to sit in that these buses is the front seat you'll see the m really the maximum amount of stuff and you'll have a great time oh we forgot the seats in here all right now we need um one two so as soon as you walk in you have two seats like so and we have like one in the middle to separate them from one two um eh, let me put three it doesn't matter oops not like this come on oh i come okay cool now that side ah all right and this is fantastic you know i always wanted to build this bridge bus but i never got the time to do it as a tutorial and i keep thinking i'll do it next time i'll do it that time i'll do you know what i mean so let's put loads of people in there again in here this bus is fully packed with people looks like father and son or a mother and a daughter <laughs> but without long hair 
all right um again put the brown carpet all over the place i did put conductor in here i'll make sure i leave that space for the conductor all aboard all aboard all right um put that in there like he's watching people getting on and off the bus and just we need the head anyway so let's put this the head and we need the jumper because it's very cold <laughs> and I think this is all the bus is done yep so basically as you can see the inside part was really easy make sure you start from the front line you leave space and just go one two three four five six ten or twenty <laughs> no I'm joking two four six seats and put as many heads as you like from the outside looks like really really busy bus i love it and i really hope you do love it too boys and guys ladies and gentlemen please don't forget to leave a like favor and sub that would be great big support and i thank you all again for your support stay tuned and i'll be seeing you soon in another tutorial or another video hopefully you enjoyed this video and a like would be so so much appreciated till next time for now bye bye